I am so sorry. I started my video late. But this is what I did first. I rendered down some pancetta. And uh, I'm going to put these in at the end because I like these in my collard greens. Because that's the word making today, collard greens. And I put my onions in. Let them sweat down a little bit. And then I put my garlic in there. And let that sweat down. You don't have to put any salt in there. Not right away. Because this right here is very salty. So you want to adjust at the end what you, um, how much salt you're going to add. So as I rendered down that fat in there from the pancetta, and I put my onions in there, let them cook now. And then I put my garlic in. And next I'm going to put in my collard greens. Okay, now these are my collard greens, and what I do. I wash them and I remove the stem and then I cut them in big chunks like this, you know, and then I just let them cook in there, rinse them off, clean them off, and then I do like a julienne chop. But I remove the stem because it's very fibrous and it really takes a long time to cook. So I'm going to take all of this right here and dump it in the pan. Put all the rest of that in there. All right, that out of way. And then, I'm gonna let this cook down for like maybe two to three minutes. And then I'm gonna start adding some more seasonings in there as it goes cooking down. Okay, then we're back. Guess what, it took two minutes for this to render down some. Let it cook down, especially these collard greens. And now, what I'm going to do, this is about, say about two and a half cups of chicken broth. Chicken broth, yeah. An organic chicken broth. Usually I would use a uh, bone broth, but I didn't have any today. And what I'm going to do, like I said near the end, once I put those up, these little bacon bits back in there. Like I said, these are very salty. And I'm going to let this cook down for about 30, 35 minutes. Okay, I put a, a, a teaspoon of smoked paprika and some red pepper flakes. I put that bacon back in there because there's so much saltiness coming from that pancetta. I wanted to flavor it in there. So I'm going to put the lid back on and let it finish out its duration of cooking. Oh, boy, it's going to be good. Well, as you can see, the pan is empty. But these collard greens are nice and tender. And they are giving me life. Oh, my goodness. Mmm, look at that grass-fed steak. Some mushrooms. Pancetta. Mm -mm. This is a wonderful keto Sunday thing. Well, guys, thank you for watching this video. This is Bonnie from Heart Healthy Lifestyle. And you guys have a great night.